up? It's Larry again, coming at you from Facebook, Troll and Toad, Pat Cracker. Today, we have something really special for you guys. And you didn't even introduce the man behind the camera. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mark. Hey. I'm, I'm joined today by the man behind the camera, Spirit Dragon Mark. Everybody say hi to Spirit Dragon Mark. Uh, I'm, the, the I'm one half of the Twin Twilight Dragons, also known as Jimmy, really known as Mark. But hey, this is our, like, this, I'm really excited. This is our first little uh, foray into oh, doing yeah. these together. It's uh, really cool. Did you, uh, did, oh, you didn't go to, did you go to Gen Con? No, man, I didn't get to make it. I, I have a, my wife and kid, you know, I have to oh, take yeah, care yeah. of them, you know. It's just, it, don't, I'm not, you know, blaming them for not getting to enjoy myself at Gen Con, you know. It's just like, when you're married, you have to, you know, make some priorities. You gotta make some priorities, yeah. Well, they just got back, everybody said they had a good time. Uh, I'm, I'm, su I'm super happy for everybody. Sucks that I couldn't go, me and you right. couldn't go, but that's all right. There's gonna be Dragon Con September the 1st, uh, and, and it's through the fourth, actually. Yeah, like and that's another one that you can come and join us and you know, sell us your cards. We can sell you cards and everybody can leave us some money. So, I mean, we can all have a good time at that. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a great one. Yeah, everybody just bring all your stuff. We'll be there. Hopefully some of the boys will be there. Right. Uh, don't forget about our pack crackers every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at three. And we got a magic show tomorrow. Yes, which is, you know, as like we've always pointed out, like I love to, you know, enjoy magic, so. If you want to join us tomorrow at 9, you know, Eastern Standard Time, like, we'd love for you to hang out with us and, you know, maybe you see something sweet that you want to buy. Hey, and did you know uh, what today is? Today is the eclipse that, you know, is coming around here. What is it, like 2 o'clock or so? Here where we are, yeah, about 2, 2.30, something like that. Yeah, Let me so, tell you what. I know something you don't know. What, what, what is that? Troll is doing a special discount to everybody that... Uh, buys any guardian or I'm sorry any sun and moon because oh, of the eclipse. I like that. Ten percent off all sun and moon singles. That's sick. From just sun and moon. Uh, that's sun and moon, guardians rising, burning shadows, all those, and it's eclipse ten. E C L I or yeah E C E C L I P S E one zero eclipse ten. Eclipse ten, y'all. So if you want to get some sweet deals on Pokemon Sun and Moon packs. Come to trollingtoad.com and you get those sweet packs for it. It's a special, like, once in a lifetime occasion. So, let's go ahead and get to open these packs, Mark. Yeah, so let's we do it, find do anything it. good. All right. Now, we'll start with, go ahead and Guardians Rising, which is probably the middle of the three and uh, is probably my favorite out of the three so far. It's probably mine too. I really liked it. I like all the Alolan characters. Oh, yeah. I love Alolan Pokemon. Like, it's such a nice twist to, you know, your childhood, seeing, like, cool, like, uh, different versions of like you know like a Raditz head for instance like a Raditz head being a dark type always made sense to oh, me. Oh you know what's crazy is the Alolan sand shrew. Like, yeah like going from ground to ice is really cool like a little igloo. So uh, we'll go ahead and go with our reverse foil here. We got us a reverse foil Machoke. Now Machoke oh, yeah. you know Gen 1 classic just big beefy Pokemon that can just throw its opponent down and uh, you know smash them over the head if need be. It's always a good good fighting type to have. He was always an exciting Pokemon in the games as well. Oh yeah, he was like, he was just one of those more difficult Pokemon, you know, because you had to trade to get his full evolve. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All that, so. And here's one of my favorite Pokemon from uh, Sun and Moon, is Galissapod. You know, I'd be really super stoked if we got a Hyper Air out of this. Oh, me too, man. Like, if we do, like, it's going to be lit. For it's real. A nice little foil card. Yeah, Galissapod is actually uh, the boss of uh, Team Skull's Pokemon. Oh, is it really? Yeah, like, it's really really strong surprisingly and uh we'll go ahead and go to base sun and moon and see if we can get something good out of that we only gotta see how many are we gonna open the two of each so we can still display them at the end yeah, yeah. we're gonna open two of each yeah, yeah. and uh let's see if we the can Guardian rising what a good set man oh yeah man it's so well, good sun and moon in general like i love the generation like it's just really innovative and really cool i had a lot of cool mechanics to the game and for reverse foil you know he's, he's not bad it's like it's a ghost ground type. Like, you know, it's pretty sick considering. And yeah, it's yeah, a sand castle. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's awesome. Sandy gas. Like, I love that. Yeah, can you imagine like being out there and then your sun, sand castle just comes alive? And our rare is a cloister, which is one of my favorite water types from Gen 1. Because, you know, it's just a giant, like, spiked, heavy metal looking clam. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks like you should be a member of Gore. Yeah, like, Gore um, definitely. Don't Google Gore, by the way. Yeah, it would definitely, like, be about it and have it as a mask off if they could. So that was that pack, and finally we'll go to Burning Shadows, which is the latest set in uh, Guardians and Sun and Moon, Guardians Rising, and you know just probably one of the better like sets that you can get financially. Like you can get a lot of good like ultras and secrets out of it. Which for 
instance, we get a full oh, Art yeah. of War GX. Now that's what we're talking about. That is a card right there. Now that car is actually one of the better cars in the competitive scene right now. It has a lot of hype and hopefully it'll live up to that hype. But yeah, it's a really, really strong GX that they've made for this set right here. That's a pretty good little uh, pull right there. Oh yeah. I mean, I'm so, I'm so, I'm, the Hyper Airs are my favorite. I think oh, yeah. the, they're so beautiful. The Hyper Air Sylveon, I believe. Right, like that's they're, just they're really them. sick. Uh, I think uh, I like I like classic full arts, you know, but I love textured arts as just as well. Like <laughs> back in my day, there weren't even a thing as full. Yeah, arts. exactly. Like man, Pokemon. we're we're old. Yeah, we are. We're getting up there in our years. Don't remind me. All right, so our reverse full in this pack is Ori Ori Ko, I think is how you pronounce that. I'm not quite sure. Ori the, yeah, there's a uh, four different versions of that for the four different islands in the have, game. Have you noticed that? Uh, Electric Pokemon are always like fuzzy. Yeah, always. Like they're always like, fuzzy. Like, I think it's just the things like static electricity, like, you know, yeah. they have to have that. You know, it's just like, I mean, there's a few exceptions, but, you know, it's either like they're a compressed ba uh, battery or like a fuzzy Pokemon if they're an animal. And then our rare, we have a Talon Flame, which is one of my favorite flying types because it's really, really strong in a competitive scene, especially in the actual. That's an awesome Pokemon. Yeah. That's killer right there. That's awesome. Yeah, like in the actual video games, it's one of the better like fire flying types and can actually, you know, compete with Charizard as one of the like, you know, pristine fire flying types in the game. So that's awesome. Alright, here we go to, back to the base set. See if we can get us a nice Incineroar GX or something like that. That'd be awesome. He's a starter in this, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. like man, it, all the starters are really cool. Like Prime Arena, Incineroar, Decidueye. Decidueye is like the best starter, I think, because it's a ghost grass type. Like that's really, really unique. That's a unique, that's a very unique Pokemon. Yeah, like, and he's like, he's like Robin Hood, you know? Yeah. So that's really cool. All right, we have Hariyama, which is a fighting type for Gen 3, which is also, you know, a sumo wrestler. Like. I mean, I, like his hands are huge, man. Like he just like smash you together, like you wouldn't even be able to react. I like how his move is Megaton slap push. I know it's just like what you got. Like he's gonna slap you until you just can't feel. Yeah, that's really cool. And our rare is Crabominable. Crabominable is really sweet because it uh, starts out as a little bitty crab, uh, like that you can find in a berry patch in the game, and like he just becomes a fighting ice type, you know. So he could just so beat you to that. Like a lot of these Pokemon are very unique. Oh yeah, like they did really good like on this generation compared to the last few generations. All right, all right last one. Yep. Was so, it Guardians Rising? Yep. Or Burning, Burning Shadows. Shadows. Burning Shadows. All yeah. right. Burning That's Shadows. Really Let's see I'm if pretty... we can get that uh, Charizard that we so long for. Oh yeah. I think we I think we have a good good shot at it. Well, our reverse foil is a little Noi Bat. Noi Bat, you know, is a. Uh, one of the dragon types, I think it was from uh, Gen... It's a dragon type? Yeah, it wow. actually turns into a dragon type. Uh, it starts as flying, but it turns into a dragon type in Gen 6. It's, uh, it's a bat that becomes a dragon. It's That's really, awesome. really cool. And I wish they would've did that with Zubat in the beginning. Uh, you know, like, Crobat's not bad eventually no, when Crobat's you get that. Bad. You know, it's not terrible. All right, and our rare? Well, we got us some Brushix. Oh, Bruxix. Yeah. Bruxix. Bruxix. Uh, what a hard name to say. Yeah, it's 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 all right. It's you know not terrible. The, we've had worse pulls, and you know oh, yeah. like I just the Pokemon itself like I'm just not a big fan of the design, but like it's still like you know some people might actually love it, and you know if you do go for it, man. Like I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. All right, guys. Well, well that's all we got for that. Oh wait a minute, didn't we have something special we wanted to show, them, Mark? Yeah, we figured because we didn't think we would actually pull one, we actually brought one down from the warehouse and went and found it. So, here is the beautiful Charizard Hyper Rare GX, who can do 300 damage. Yes. Like, straight up. The drawback is you have to get rid of your fire energies, but you can go and guarantee one shot something. Oh, there. you're going to just destroy something. Like, just you're going to burn. Extremely just gone. You're going to, uh, you know, straight up Game of Thrones them as oh, a good, yeah. good term the way how it would end. That's oh, yeah. a great card, man. That's beautiful. Oh yeah, it's amazing. And just show you just real quick of how like pretty it is. Hang on, hang on. Uh, go ahead. And just look how beautiful that card is. It's just, you know, Charizard's always a classic. I, I wish they would do hyper rares of the other two. Like oh yeah, Venusaur, like Blastoise. Blastoise. Like, I, like I'm surprised there hasn't been a Blastoise, you know, or a well, Venusaur. Because he's super popular anyways. 
Yeah, I mean, the original starters, man. Like, I always was a Blastoise guy, like, for my starter, just because, like, it, I love turtles, and, you know, like, you get a turtle with, like, cannons. So, I mean, it's even more amazing. Oh, yeah. So, uh, again, guys, we just want to thank you for joining us, and uh, don't forget tomorrow we got our magic show at 9 p.m. And Pack Crackers Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Yeah, we got our Pack Crackers Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So just come, you know, hang out with me, and me and Mark can even join in every now and then. Hey, and don't forget that uh, that coupon code was Eclipse 10, E-C-L-I-P-S-E-1-0 for 10% off all Sun and Moon base sets, Sun and Moon Guardians Rising, Sun and Moon Burning Shadows, Shadows, and a whole lot. Oh, yeah. So we'd definitely love for you to come join us again at Dragon Con here in September. You know, if you just want to hang out with us and just tell us, you know, how we're doing with the show and like tell us if you love pack crackers, if you hate pack crackers, just let, give us your opinion. We hope you love us. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Because we try. We really try to make, you know, make everybody happy. Well, but I, Mark, it's been good hanging been out with fun, you, man. man. This has been a good first run for me at the same time. I like it. I'm oh, usually yeah. behind the camera last time you did it and I couldn't say anything, but now, right. oh, they gave me a mic. I think we have good witty banter. We have witty banter. Yes. All right, man. Well, thank you, guys. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Peace out.